Okay, question one is um, a summing series question. So to start with, I'm just going to separate these into the three parts that we're going to need to calculate um, separately. And for this one, I'm going to write it as minus eight lots of the sum of the ones. And that's all going to be from one to n. So for the sum of um, the r squared terms from 1 to n, we've got that in our formula booklets, but you should know that it's um, 1 over 6 n, n plus 1, 2 n plus 1. This one we don't have, but it is the square root of the r cubed terms, which you do have in your formula booklet, but again you should know it, and that's a half n, n plus 1. And this one is going to be 8 lots of the sum of all the 1s, so, and there'll be n 1s, so that's just going to be 8 lots of n. Okay, so to simplify this now, um, we're going to want to think of these terms all over 6, so we can take out a 6. So that would be the same as 3 over 6. And this would be the same as 48 over 6. So we can then take out a sixth n from each of our three terms, which is going to leave us with n plus 1, 2n plus 1. It's going to leave us with three lots of n plus 1. Oops. And it's going to leave us with minus 48. So next job, I'm going to expand these brackets. And this is going to become uh, 2n squared plus 3n plus 1. We've got take 3n and take 3 here and take 48. So that is going to become a 6n. We've then got 2n squared the three n's cancel, so we've got minus 50. I can take another two now out from here. We've got n squared take 25, and that's a difference of two squares, so we can then rewrite that finally as n plus five. Oh, I've lost my two. Oh no, the two's been taken out. n plus five, n minus five. So that's your answer to part one.